I'm Tiffany Young for ID8 TV, and I just met Rico, who apparently is also my neighbor, and um, that's exciting. So, yay, K Town. I know, I know, right? Right? Okay, so. K Town, Los Angeles. Exactly. <laughs> So I want to talk about your acting career. You have a lot of exciting things coming up, I and do. Um, but first, like, can you give me an idea of like how you got started with acting and like some of your first work? Yeah, I've I've been acting ever since. Well, professionally, I started acting about eight years ago here in Los Angeles. Well, in Los Angeles, and um, but I've been doing theater from the Bay Area ever since I was like 12 years old. So I've always loved TV. I've always loved, especially sci-fi. I've always loved sci-fi ever since I was a little kid. Always wanted to be in a sci-fi project. Um, but I always wanted to act. I would see people on TV and, you know, think in my mind, I, I could do that. I'd love to do that. I had, like, people that I grew up watching and idolizing and just wanted to, knew that one day I wanted to do what they do. And um, I was blessed enough to be able to do a lot of theater and TV, or I'm sorry, theater and film up in the Bay Area. And eventually you have to move down to LA if you really want to do the big stuff. So that's when um, that's when a lot of TV work kicked in. And so I was blessed enough to be able to do a lot of comedy, which I never thought I'd be doing, um, and a lot of drama and a lot of sci-fi, which was great because I'm acting alongside a lot of people that I grew up watching and emulating and being fans of and stuff like that. So yeah, yeah. Does anybody still make you starstruck? Pretty much everybody. It's like, well, it's one of those things where it's like, if there are people that I watched and, and admired, and all of a sudden I'm meeting them, or I get the chance to work with them, I still geek out a little bit. I still geek out a little bit. Like I, I worked with Walter Koenig from um, who plays Chekhov in Star Trek: The Original Series, and I worked. I, I've, I've met him. I've worked with him on Star Trek: Renegades, and um, you know, just knowing him is still like, wow. It's 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 a it's great to be able to work with the people that that you've grown up and you know just watch. I, I, I still pinch myself in the business just doing what I do in general. So <laughs> that's exciting. So yeah. tell us about all of your uh, upcoming stuff. Really. Well, I'm going to be on the Orville, the new Seth, Seth MacFarlane uh, sci-fi series on on Fox that's coming out in the fall. Um, I do a lot of voiceover work as well. So I have like four commercials out right now. Uh, one voiceover for a McDonald's Big Pick Two commercial. I'm also in uh, Kraft Macaroni and Cheese. Um, oh gosh, which other? What's the other one? Um, Direct TV. So many. Direct yeah. TV as well as Lending Tree. Oh my God. Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> so. Are there any lines where we could be like, okay, I totally remember that commercial? Um, like if if you saw it, you would know it, or, or what do you ask? If you said like a line from a commercial, like. Mm, um. Well, in the Lending Tree commercial, the big thing that kind of stands me out is I open up the mailbox and the puppet jumps out and I scream like a girl when I do it. So it's actually what got me the thing. So I'm just like, ah! And yeah, it's actually a pretty funny little little scene. And, and so, yeah. That's funny. I love watching commercials. <laughs> yeah, it was, there's a lot of really good ones out there. So yeah, yeah there's a lot of fun. There's a lot of fun. Exactly. So what do you love most about coming to Comic-Con? I love seeing the people, the costumes. I mean, there's some really great creativity coming out of a lot of these people's minds, and you know, it's like they're—it's all emulating people that they that they like or people that they grew up watching or reading about. I love seeing, you know, sci-fi has so many different definitions to it. It's. It's comics. It's 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 uh, TV and film. It's you know it's superheroes. It's magic. It's horror. So I just love the fact that it's a convention where everybody can come together and just be be themselves, just nerd out and and have fun doing it. You know, guys, girls, tall, short, fat, skinny, black, white, what have you. You know, it's just like everybody's here and it's it's always a great time. I I, I really love the people though. I really love the fans and watching people just come through and. Just have fun. Just, yeah. just be. We're all nerds here, you know. It's, it's crazy. It's, 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 an, it's exciting. It's like an exciting exactly. time. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Well, thank you so much, and wish you the best of luck in your career and everything. Thank you. Thank you. Come back. Come okay. back and, and, and see. Uh, uh, well, table A thirteen. So I'm here all weekend. So. We're here. <laughs> oh, and oh, if I can do a shameless plug, um, I just, I just launched my website. It's ricoanderson.com. 
ricoanderson.com. And um, on social media, it's I am Rico Anderson, which is from Facebook, Twitter, as well as Instagram. So. All right, you guys, follow him. Thank you. <laughs> All right, thank you. Tiffany Young for ID8 TV.